Uh, so I'm here with my my dear friend and client, or my dear client and friend, no, uh, Sharif and uh, Lukman. And Lukman, who had, how do you guys know each other? We met like I don't know years. Yeah. Many years ago. Yeah. When I was back in uh, Russia, okay. I was a teacher, yeah. teaching English, and uh, so Lukman was one of my students actually. Lukman was teaching you English. No, uh, vice versa. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What brought you to our country from Russia? Uh, uh, I kind of run away from uh, Russian police department. Political asylum. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Wow, that's intense, and I know I, there's a lot going on in the world today. Yeah. And so, what's it been like the last nine months, leaving your country and coming to, you know, a, a new country and integrating here? When I come to the United States, no, uh, it was difficult for me because I have baby, two years old. She was at the time like one and a half years. What's her name? Her name is Rayana. Rayana. Yes. That's pretty. Yeah. And wife. Um, now she's she's pregnant. My wife. Wow. With number two. Yeah. Good work, man. <laughs> Thank you. That's exciting. <laughs> yeah. Of course, it was difficult. Uh, first of all, the reason is because uh, I came here with the family. The, for me, as a father, is uh, more uh, important for uh, my child live uh, uh, in good condition. I mean, um, and the struggle was like um, to get a job. I still don't have job, and the reason is because I don't have uh, unnecessary papers for jobs, and then uh, it's. Uh, it's expensive to live here in the United States. Well, I will tell you that Sharif, he's a, he's a wonderful man. He's, a really he's become a very good friend of mine. I met him as a client, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah. Yeah, he was a client of mine. And then we became friends, and um, and we've, we've been friends for many years now, many years. And um, he shared a little bit of, of your story and kind of, you know, what you guys are going through and moving here. and trying to integrate into a new country yeah. which I can't imagine you know I can't imagine how hard that would be uh, with work and with the stress it puts on you and you know your wife your baby now you're got another baby on the way and so um, uh, so listen we wanted to just bring you on today and, and say hello and welcome to our country yeah thank you welcome to the USA and also wanted to just give you a little something to help you I think it's not necessary man uh, no, just, no. just, just to, no. just to, just to bless you, uh, and welcome you to the country. No, I cannot accept. That. Uh, and, but and we, we do this because we can only imagine what it would be like for you to be coming here while your country is going through a lot and having a child and having a baby. And, and I, I am sure that you would do the same for, for someone like me if I was in Russia. I'm sure you would. And so Sharif and I, you know, we kind of we kind of set this up, and and this is and this is a thousand dollars for no, you. I can't, I cannot take it. Every every month we do this. We we have a one k giveaway, and um, we we give a thousand dollars to someone who who's in need who could use it. And um, I believe that's that's from God. You know, that's you. that's God's blessing for you today, Luke Man. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you so much. God bless you. So Sharif loves you. He cares for you, and and was thinking about your need, man. And I I know this is is going to be a blessing right now. And you know, may may God prosper you in our country. May your next child be born healthy, and and bring you guys peace and prosperity. And and uh, I think it's going to be okay, man. If you know someone in need, uh, you can go to 1kgiveaway.com. All right, everybody, peace out. Thank you. All right. <laughs>